Hello, greetings and salutations guys, how are you doing? Welcome back Megan, I'm glad to have you here on board. Um, I'm ready to see what this game is about, What is that the main character? Yeah, this guy here, um, this guy there is, that guy there is Gordon Freeman, he's the protagonist uh, of the game. I'm late. <laughs> Yeah, just a little bit. I'm gonna tell you why though. 8-bit, how are you man? Hope you're doing okay. We're gonna start uh, with Half-Life 1 today. Uh, we, we already finished uh, Tomb Raider 1 and Silent Hill, so... Here we are with some Half-Life. Um, I'm a little bit late because I was running some tests. Uh, I was watching yesterday's stream. Like the... Uh, uh, like the recorded version oh, well not recorded but like the streamed version and it looked like crap man <laughs> it looked so horrible like the it, it, it was so messy so blocky and I think the bitrate was too low so um, I was running some tests uh, regarding the quality of the stream yeah it was it was so blurry um, Honestly, if I was a new guy and I got in, into a stream like that, I would have immediately left because it was so blurry. It was so, uh, like, uh, the image quality was hideous. So I was messing with the bitrate of today's stream. I, I was thinking about if I wanted to stream in 60 FPS or 30 FPS. So for now, it's like 60 FPS and it has a higher, a higher bitrate, so... Hopefully, it looks nice today. If I start running into issues, maybe the speed is too high, maybe I should stream in at, at 30 FPS. I'm gonna change those settings midstream. But for now, I hope um, I hope this works. <laughs> Again, um, okay, let's get rid of the music. Um, again, if you guys are experiencing any issues, please do let me know, and we're gonna try to fix it. So it's actually quite cold. It's quite cold here. I'm just gonna put on my jacket. I don't know why it's, it's so cold. Um, so the uh, game, Darts blowing raspberries at you, <laughs> blowing raspberries. Oh, what? Is that like an expression? Because a raspberry is like a fruit. Blow and blast raspberries. Is she like uh, throwing uh, raspberries with her mouth? Or what do you mean with that? I'm not sure. Okay, let's put on my glasses. You stick your tongue out and blow. Oh, like this? <laughs> oh wow, I didn't know that was blowing raspberries. I thought I thought raspberry raspberries was like a fruit. <laughs> oh, that's so cute. I can't imagine her now. I can't imagine your daughter. Well, I hope your daughter enjoys the stream as well. <laughs> You, you can tell your daughter that <laughs> I am blowing raspberries at her too. Okay, let's go guys. So the story in this game, okay, I already played Half-Life once. It was a long time ago. It is a fruit. Oh, so it's, a, it's an expression then. I get it. Um, I played Half-Life once in the past. I, I remember very little about this game's story. I know that the protagonist is Gordon Freeman. He's a scientist, he's a doctor, um, a physicist or something. And he's working at this uh, facility called Black Mesa. Uh, I don't know what exactly they do there. But they run like some experiments and... Well, that's pretty much all I know. <laughs> I played Half-Life demo as a kid. It shut me up. <laughs> okay, man. Okay, 8-bit. Um, well, you're gonna have the chance to experience the game again this time. So, I hope you enjoy. 
the the game and hopefully the the quality is going to be good enough because since it's it's a, a first person shooter it's gonna involve a lot of movement and you know like quick turns and a lot of action I guess so yeah let's jump into the game man let's jump into the game guys also this game okay let's start the game this game has no subtitles so I decided to leave the game sound and my voice at the same volume like game game sound is not uh, like muffled this time because uh, you're gonna have to rely on hearing the dialogues and if I'm if it's uh, too quiet you're not gonna hear you know you're gonna you're not gonna hear those and you might me you might miss like bits of the story so if it's too loud if the game sound is too loud please let me know and we're gonna fix that so let's go let's go almost forgot to switch the screens almost did oh also for this okay for this run <clears throat> I'm gonna be playing okay what's going on with the image sweet Jesus not again Okay, let, let, let me start the game again cuz I just I just I just tested it like 20 minutes ago and it was perfect so I don't know what this game like sometimes OBS decides to ignore the 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 game oh there we go okay we're fine um I'm going to be playing on hard difficulty last time I played this it was on on normal I think so this time we're going to be playing on hard and in addition we're going to be um, you know as I was talking about that yesterday um, I don't like I don't like to rely on saving you know like um, I, I, I don't want to rely on that so we just we're not gonna save manually at all on, in the game this is just an idea I don't know if it's possible to do that but for now, I'm just gonna uh, refrain from saving manually, and I'm gonna let the game save for me. So, which if I if we die, we're gonna go back to the le to the last auto save that the game did for us. So death has a cost here. I'm not gonna like saving saving every five minutes. So that's a little bit of an added challenge. So yeah, Megan, 8-bit, everybody else that is on the chat right now, let's go. New game. Good luck. Thank you, 8-bit. Thank you, and I hope you enjoy. Okay, uh, f uh, we're gonna we're gonna play the training room because I I'm not very familiarized with the controls. I mean, I looked at them at the menu like right here. These are the controls, but I want to play the tutorial because, like, uh, if I'm gonna be playing on this on hard, I have to be, I have to really dominate the, the controls. So let's do that for now. Okay, hazard curse. Oh, that's that's like the I think that's the name of this tutorial mission. <laughs> Okay, uh, it's actually a little bit too loud here on my headphones, so let me do something. Okay. So, W, A, S, D to move around. Mouse to look around. Let's go. Hello and welcome to the Black Mesa Hazard Course, where you will be trained in the use of a hazardous environment suit. I am your holographic assistant. Let's begin by stepping into your suit. You can see it suspended up ahead of you. If you see one of these buttons, press it, and I will appear to demonstrate certain moves. Okay, so uh, right now here, we are already at the Black Mesa facility, but here we are uh, at the training course. 
So you can see this black mesa thing is like a. It looks like a secret um, facility to me, like a Area 51 or something like that. So uh, let's go and put on our suit. Also, well, when there's dialogue, I'm gonna try to stay quiet so you guys can hear the dialogue. Welcome to the HEV Mark 4 protective system for use in hazardous environment conditions. Okay. So that was the suit uh, talking to us. Uh, it's basically a suit uh, to protect us from hazard. Um, okay, let's go. Uh, I think I missed... what? Oh, never mind, never mind. Moving around in your HEV suit can be slightly disorienting at first. Take a moment to familiarize yourself with basic movement, and soon it will fit you like a second skin. I will see you just around the corner. Okay, perfect. We're just gonna familiarize ourselves with the suit. Um, I know, I'm noticing that the movement here is like so fast. So, I'm expecting this to be sort of like a wake. All of those games that have really uh, fast research. I don't remember this game being that good. The first move we will practice in the hazard course is basic jumping. You will attempt to get over this set of pipes using only your run and jump commands. It helps to get a running start. Watch me and then try it yourself. <laughs> That's so cool. That's so cool to see. Oh, wait a second. If I press this... Oh, it doesn't work. The first move we oh. will practice in the hazard course is basic jumping. Okay. You will attempt to get over this set of pipes using only your run and jump commands. It helps to get a running start. Watch me and then try it yourself. Okay, let's see. This is just jumping, so you jump with the space bar. That's very intuitive. Look at these scientists. Watching, watching me. Good work. Those new suits can be tricky. Please proceed to the next area. Oh, thank you. Okay, let's go. You will now duck under the next set of obstacles. Please note that crouching will automatically shift your suit into stealth mode, minimizing movement noise. Okay, now we're gonna duck, and I actually forgot what the duck key was. Oh, uh, left shift, okay. There we go. So now we're learning to duck. Very good. I hardly noticed you. Move on to the next area. Okay, let's keep going. Hopefully the dialogues are, um, are loud and clear. Now we will combine skills. You will need to jump, duck, and then jump again. This will prepare you for the next room, where you will have to do both moves at the same time. Okay, so this is like a combination. Good work. You will look prepared for the next station. To get into these pipes, you will have to signal your suit to make a duck jump. You'll want to stand right at the mouth of the pipe and continue to press forward. Then jump up, and while you're in mid-air, go into a crouch. It's tricky, but you'll oh. find it comes in handy. Yeah, I remember. Oh, okay, uh, it's basically I jump, and then I like contract my legs, so... If I just try to jump into this... Yeah, I remember this one. If I try to jump into this pipe, I won't be able to, because my legs won't let me. So I have to actually, like... Uh, rise my legs in the middle of, of the jump, so like that. There we go. Nice job. Okay, no, no, uh, congratulations this time. Not the scientist. Walk 
directly into the ladder, look up, and continue moving forward. If you want to come back down, just move backward. Okay. Okay, get it. The next three jumps get harder each time, but they are quite possible. <laughs> Don't be surprised if you miss the last one a time or two. If you can make all three in a continuous run, you are doing well. So it's basically jumping like three uh, jumps in a row. If oh you keep boy. falling short, you might be jumping too soon. Yeah, okay, uh, I, I thought it was... Piece of cake. Oh, what the hell? I'm jumping too late. Let's try this again. Oh boy. Okay, this is... what? This is kind of a hard jump. There we go. Great work. Now there's one more style of jumping you need to learn. Long jumping requires its own charging module, seen here. To activate your long jump, you will have to duck and move forward, and then launch into a jump. Once you're up on the platform, press the button and I will demonstrate the move. Okay, uh, so before left, feed her after you blew your aspiration, so you blow one. I was reaching for the screen. Oh, that's so cute. That is so cute. Yeah, I think I already like your family already. Oh, I said already two times. Oh, whatever. My English sucks. Okay, so this is the long jumping module, I think. Power assist movement activated. Okay. While moving forward, hold down dock key, then press jump. Oh, Yinai, welcome back, man. How are you doing? Glad to have you here on board. Hope you're doing fine, man. Hey, man. So good to see you here, man. We're starting Half Life today. We're actually playing the tutorial mission, so uh, you're just about. You just came here. In time. Uh, okay, so we have to make a long jump here. Oh, by the way, thank you for the host. Thank you, thank you, thank you, man. I have to jump and then press space. So, I mean... Nice okay. job. Uh, yeah, I duck and then I press space. Yes, yeah, sort of like that leaping move. I duck and then... Let my suit make the super jump. Okay, that's fine. You're welcome. Yeah, and we're we're, we're doing we're uh, playing uh, Half-Life on hard, like campaign mode, and uh, with the no no manual saves challenge. I don't know if that's doable. Hopefully it is. But it it basically means I will only load auto saves. I'm not gonna be manual saving this. So I'm just gonna use uh, the checkpoints the game gives me. Let's let's go down these stairs. Please start the lift by moving up to the button, looking at it, and pressing the use key. Okay, so the use key is E, which is weird because I'm more used to F. Oh, so F is the flashlight. Yeah, I remember. Okay. Now that you're up here, there's only one way down. Find the target on the floor below and do your best to hit it. If you take any damage from the fall, we will administer medical care at the next station. <laughs> okay. Well, that's reassuring. Okay, I just have to land in that, like, uh, bullseye. Let's do that. Ooh. Yeah, I took some damage. So... Uh, those numbers down there in the bottom left corner, uh, the, the 79 is my health, and I think the other number, which right now 
reach zero is my shield. I think, I'm not sure, but I'm like 90% sure. Uh, let's see if we're missing something. I was gonna say, oh, look at this shimmy uh, ledge. Too much Tomb Raider, guys. <laughs> I've been playing too much Tomb Raider. Because this is, totally looks like a shimmy ledge. You will find med okay. kits like this one throughout the Black Mesa compound. To restore your health, walk up to a med kit and press your use key. Your health will recover gradually until you are at full health or the kit is depleted. Once the light goes out, a med kit cannot be reused. So this is what I mean. Um, these are like the uh, medical stations I was talking about yesterday. Uh, you just have to find them and you can't like pick them up. I can use them until my health is 100 and then that's it. Like I can't stack on med kits or any of that. So I, I I don't remember if you actually find like med kits that uh, you can like pick up and use. I I don't remember. We're gonna have to see. But the thing is, you don't have an inventory here, so we can't like uh, hoard items. Okay, what else? To spin that bridge, walk up to the control wheel and press the use key. Okay. So it's kind of timed, right? Oh, okay. Fantastic. Okay, let's keep going. Sometimes you'll need to rely on more than just your suit to get through a tight place. Try jumping this gap on your own. What you really need to do is push that box down into the pit. Pushing is easy. Just move forward against the box and you can push it into position. Okay, let's do that. Oh, okay, oh, okay, so I can't jump here. If I was going to... Yeah, I can't. I'm just gonna hit my head against these pipes. If you can't push the obstacle out of your way, you Look might try clock. pulling it. To pull a box, move up to it and press your use key. While holding down the use key to keep a grip on the box, move slowly backward. The box will come along with you. Okay, so that's basically pulling boxes let's try that because the fingering here is weird whoa what was that okay Oh, okay, I have to stack all of these boxes. I mean, not stack them, but uh, move them around. Finally, if nothing else works, you can try breaking the objects in your path. Make sure you picked up the crowbar, then simply smash your way through the debris. So this weapon right here is so iconic. Uh, this crowbar is usually uh, related to the Half-Life games. And there, there have been so many like easter eggs in other games about this crowbar because it's so iconic. So yeah, let's uh, move up the crow. Okay, press attack key, which is basically the left mouse button. Stop! Nice. Break and crouch. Look at the grating and press attack. Oh, so this is like a passage. Let's go. Activate your suit flashlight for the next area. Oh yeah, uh, uh, these are the uh, shield. 
these are like shield pickups, so if I approach this, you can see. Power 15%. Power 30%. That's so cool. Yeah, so you can see right now I am like I'm at like uh, thirty percent shields. So if I take damage, uh, I'm gonna lose uh, shield. Oh my gosh, these bugs are annoying me. Um, if I take damage, I think my shield is going to go down instead of the health. I think. So right here, this is. Power 45%. Hopefully you can um hopefully you can see well. So let me know how this game let me know how this stream looks in the dark, in dark sections. Uh kill it with fire. Man, if I if I had if, if I had fire right now, I would. Or maybe not. I mean I I don't feel good. Ew, that's I mean I'm just gonna go my way and let that work. Do its thing is I don't feel good about killing them, but they still like make me feel Power comfortable. 60%. Power 75%. Man, oh my gosh, did you hear that? I just stepped on one. No, that's gross. Great. That's Remember gross. your flashlight drains power. So switch it off when you don't need it. Okay, okay, so as you can see on the top right corner, um, the flashlight act actually depletes its battery. So we're gonna have to switch it off, and it will um, it will recharge back. I think. Looks tasty. <laughs> Ooh, I don't know, man. Like, uh, I, I'm fine with bugs, but uh, those bugs look like cockroaches, and co I have like a real fear of cockroaches. Like a real phobia of cockroaches, so... Ew. Okay, I think here begins our weapons training. Welcome to the Black Mesa target range, where you will receive training in firing a weapon, reloading, and firing the attached grenade launcher. Please pick up your weapon and advance to the firing station. Oh, okay, let's pick up the grenades and the ammo. Yeah, re you reload with R, that's very intuitive. Okay, I'm, I'm, I'm think I'm, I think I'm full of ammo. Um, if you're hungry, you eat anything. <laughs> well, that's true, man. That's completely true. If you're hungry, it's like... I mean, ooh, I don't know how what to think about eating bugs. But uh, it's, it's so gross. I tried once, you know, here in my country, uh, there is one region where they eat like uh, ants. If you were to translate that into English, they would be called like... Um, big ass ants because they have like uh, their butts <laughs> it's like a uh, huge so they actually it's that's a, that's like a snack there and once i tried those ants and man i don't know I... you'll have to hit every target in order to complete the course but if you miss the first time don't worry it will come around again Try to reload during pauses, rather than waiting to run out of ammunition at a critical time. To fire your grenade launcher, use your alternate fire button. Certain targets will break only when hit by grenades. Okay. Commencing sequence in 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Wait a second. Um, this game looked amazing on release. That's true, man. Because this, I think this game is from... 1998 or 1990 uh, something but I mean it's from the past century so this is more or less like on the same um, like the on the same age I don't know how to say that uh, as Tomb Raider 1 so graphically this was like very advanced back then 
For example, it's midnight here almost, and I order food, so I'm lazy to cook. <laughs> okay. Okay, well, I don't know if you order bugs. <laughs> if you order bugs. Okay. Break him. Oh, so you have to. Oh, this one is unbreakable. Oh my gosh, this one is. So I'm gonna have to. Yeah. You have sure. completed the Black Mesa target range. Please advance to the next area. Okay, that's pretty f good. Um, burst mode. No, it's not burst mode. Uh, this, I, I'm just firing bursts. Like I'm used to firing bursts. Um, I don't know if this game actually takes into account recoil. Yeah, it kind of does. It kind of does. So shooting it in bursts is. I don't know. I'm, I'm already used to uh, shooting in bursts. It's something that, that I do intu intuitively. But shooting champ, hey man, thank you, <laughs> thank you for that. I, I did. Okay, let's keep going. Your HEV suit monitors blood oxygen levels, warning you when you need to find an air supply. As you swim through this course, your oxygen levels will begin to drop. At the midpoint, you will be given an opportunity to surface for air. Okay, so that's basically my oxygen when I'm on the water. Um, I'm noticing that I'm right now I'm, I'm at 98% uh, health. I don't know how I lost two points. I didn't realize. Okay, let's jump. Let's jump into that uh, water section. Where is my oxygen though? I don't see like the uh, indicator, like the ga ga gauge. See my oh. oh, look at that O2. You will see the blood oxygen indicator on your suit's heads up display returning to its previous level. You are free to swim on to the end of the course. Oh, so I have to make it back. Um, I liked how that hologram like looked at me and it was like that. That's that's so cool. I don't know. Those little details are like I appreciate that in a game. Let's heal now. Okay. Let's keep going. This is the charging unit for your hazardous environment suit. When you are running low on power, step up to any charger and press your use key. Your suit will recharge gradually until the charge unit is depleted. Individual batteries may also be used to charge your suit. So those individual batteries we found, uh, yeah, that's basically the, uh, the suit's energy. I was calling them shields, but they call it here... Uh, suit energy so there are other uh, stations there are other kind of stations to recharge the suit they work the same way as the health stations if you pass through fire or steam you will see a heat damage icon lighting up directional indicators at the center of your display show you where damage is coming from okay we have to be, we have to be aware of, uh, of steam and fire nodes, but I don't know if this thing is going like, to explode. Oh, okay. I get it. Proximity oh. to radiation activates the Geiger counter and radiation display. Biohazards are also indicated with the luminous icon. Warning. Hazard 
Yes, this this area is radioactive, um, and I'm gonna take damage from that as well. So let's try not to stay too long in these areas. Okay. Please advance to the next area. Okay, I'm guessing I have to press this elevator. <laughs> Who has still, bro? Hey, man! Thank you, Bind, sti Bind Sticks. Welcome, man! Welcome to the welcome to the stream. Uh, this is actually a product of the of lockdown, you know, because I haven't been able to go to a barber shop and like do my hair. So, if you like this, man, that's cool. <laughs> Lead a security guard into the next room. He will let you back into the transit system. You must approach a guard and press your use key. He will follow you until you face him and press the use key again. Wow, you can actually lead people here. I don't remember being able to do that. Okay, so, hey man. Sure, I'll follow you. Now he's following me. Okay, I'll wait here. So it's just a basic uh, follow and wait here thing. Sure, I'll follow you. Okay, man, let's go. Yeah, cool. Cut it yourself. Uh, I might do that, but... I also want to have it long for now. Um, the thing is, I need to, like, fix it, because... Um, you know... Oh, okay, so this door was gonna help me open this door. Look at this! Like... Uh, back here it looks... I don't know, it looks... I don't like how it looks back here, so... I want to like... Uh, cut it a little bit back there, but... Doing it myself, I might actually like screw it up and... I mean, I don't want to, I don't know anything about... Cutting hair. Oh, it's daytime! Okay, Press your go. use key to engage the train. Press your forward and backward keys to increase or decrease the speed of the train. Press your use key again to disengage from the train. Press your use key to engage the train. Press your forward and backward keys to increase or decrease the speed of the train. Press your use key again to disengage from the train. Okay, uh, I have to use the... I have to press the use key here, which is E. And here we're gonna control the train speed. See, I remember this. If we press E, we can now go free. So let's go a little bit faster. Oh, we did it! You are now fully certified for use of the HEV Mark IV protective system. Lever? What do you mean lever? Like the um, I, I didn't see any lever. The, oh, did I say lever? <laughs> it's possible that I said lever. Sometimes I switch words because I'm a little bit dyslexic. Okay, so that was the tutorial. Um, now we're gonna start the real game. Now I want to ask you guys: Is the sound balance all right? Because right now uh, the game sound is to the max, as well as my voice. So, is the balance all right? Is the image quality all right? Is everything good? Before we start the before we start the the game. The tutorial was very hard. Yeah, like, uh, I, I don't think you can cho actually choose. No, you can't choose the tutorial, the difficulty for the tutorial. <laughs> it was very hard. Everything is good, says Eggbeat. 
Okay, uh, like I said before, uh, during this game has no subtitles, so I'm gonna try to stay quiet during dialogues, so you guys can hear. Well, you guys can hear what's going on. Um, I don't know about uh, the 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 ambient sound or like the sound effects volume, because. You know, maybe with the shooting and all the chaos or whatever, it's gonna be. You know, if 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 it comes to that, that you can't hear me because uh, of the shooting or because of the chaos or whatever, please let me know. Let's go, guys. Let's start the game. Good morning, and welcome to the Black Mesa Transit System. This automated train is provided for the security and convenience of the Black Mesa Research Facility personnel. The time is 8.47 a.m. Current topside temperature is 93 degrees, with an estimated high of 105. The Black Mesa compound is maintained at a pleasant 68 degrees at all times. Yeah, so we're, we're about to begin our shift. So it's like almost this train is inbound from level 3 dormitories to Sector C test labs and control facilities. If your intended destination is a high security area beyond Sector C, you will need to return to the Central Transit Hub in Area 9 and board a high security train. If you have not yet submitted your identity to the retinal clearance system, you must report to Black Mesa personnel for processing before you will be permitted into the high security branch of the transit system. Okay, this is the next Due to the high toxicity of material routinely handled in the Black Mesa compound, no smoking, eating, or drinking are permitted within the Black Mesa transit system. Okay, makes sense. Please keep your limbs inside the train at all times. Do not attempt to open the doors until the train has come to a complete halt at the station platform. In the event of an emergency, passengers are to remain seated and await further instruction. If it is necessary to place the train, disabled personnel should be evacuated first. Please stay away from electrified rails and proceed to an emergency station until assistance arrives. No, we didn't. What do you want me to tell you? I think it was only uh, at the transit Like this uh, rail car that we're in right now. Once we're out, like, yeah, it's perfect to find like, that technology. Mesa Hazard Course okay, Decathlon will commence this evening at 1900 hours in the Level 3 the facility. The semi-finals for high security personnel will be announced in a separate secure access transmission. Remember, more lives than your own may depend on your fitness. Do you have a friend or relative who would make a valuable addition to the Black Mesa team? Immediate openings are available yeah, see, in the see, areas see. of materials handling and low clearance security. Please contact Black Mesa personnel for further information. If you have an associate with a background in the areas of theoretical physics, biotechnology, or other high-tech disciplines, please contact our civilian recruitment division. The Black Mesa Research Facility is an equal opportunity in So yeah, as I was saying, my name is Gordon Freeman. A reminder to all Black Mesa personnel. 
Regular radiation and biohazard screenings are a requirement of continued employment in the Black Mesa Research Facility. Missing a scheduled urinalysis or radiation checkup is grounds for immediate termination. If you feel you have been exposed to radioactive or other hazardous materials in the course of your duties, contact your radiation safety officer immediately. Work safe. Work smart. Your future depends on it. Now arriving at Sector C test labs and control facilities. Okay, so we've made it here. Please stand back from the automated door and wait for the security officer to verify your identity. Before exiting the train, be sure to check your area for personal belongings. Thank you, and have a very safe and productive day. Thank you, Lee. Good morning, Mr. Yeah. Freeman. I I Looks like you're running late. Everything is all right. So I'm Gordon Freeman, as I was saying. Uh, 27 year old male, which is funny because I'm actually 28. I'm almost the same age as Gordon Freeman. I, I didn't know that. I'm a doctor, I'm a theoretical physicist from the MIT. That's really cool. Like, this guy is genius. And I'm assigned to anomalous materials section or laboratory. That's, that's where I work. So I'm guessing that's section C, which is this place. Um, but the game sound is a bit loud on my end. I'm not sure if it's for everyone. It might be. It might be. So I'm gonna do something. I'm gonna turn it down a little bit. The important thing, I mean, what I want for you guys is to be able to hear the dialogues. Because there are no, I really wanted to activate subtitles, but I could find no mods or no options for that. This game just has no subtitles, so we're gonna have to rely on listening, listening on uh, the dialogues. So hopefully that's a little bit better. I turned the oh boy, I turned down the volume a little bit, uh, the volume a little bit. So let me know if that's better. Oh, wait a second, I'm using the wrong chair. <clears throat> okay, let's keep going. Let's keep going with Half-Life, guys. Let's go to work. Sorry, sir. I've got to stay at my post. Okay. Sorry. <laughs> Anomalous materials. That's the uh, division. <laughs> Look at that Black Mesa Research Facility. And must remember to report that fluctuation. This looks to be like run by the government, cause there's like a map. I don't know. Now, where did I leave that shutdown procedure chart? Hey, Mr. Freeman, I had a bunch of messages for you, but we had a system crash about 20 minutes ago, and I'm still trying to find my files. Just one of those days, I guess. They were having some problems down in the test chamber too, but I think that's all straightened out. They told me to make sure you headed down there as soon as you got into your hazard suit. Okay. 
We have to get the hazard suit first. Can't see my body. I, I wanted to look my outfit right now. Okay, that's it. Can Can we do this later? You'll just have to wait until after the test. Weren't you supposed to be in the test chamber half an hour ago? Yeah, oh, I'm late. Okay, I'm sorry. I, I'll, I'll go to the test chamber. Uh, anomalous materials labs research. Development facilities. Okay, we got, we have to find the test chamber too. I think. I don't think so. Please leave me alone until after the experiment. Oh my God! Yeah, sorry. it's good to see you. So look at the stripes. Uh, do we want to follow the red stripe? Have you seen my coffee cup? Uh, let's go this way. I don't asking know exactly. Question. Oh, I know this guy, so... There is a very mysterious character here. Actually in Half-Life 2 as well, which is the G-Man. It's right here, this guy in the suit. This guy is like watching you. Sometimes he appears uh, out of nowhere, like in places that makes you wonder like, what is this guy doing here? This right here, this man, this gentleman with the business case business case and he's the g-man and i don't know what's to do with him he's just very mysterious are you 100 percent sure that theory of yours is correct i have no doubt yeah this these people are geniuses okay that's sector b do we want to go to sector b coolant res re re reserve i guess facility no, I, I don't think that's where we have to go. That's Listen up, this is going to run perfectly today, don't you think? Hello. Hey, man. No smoking area. Let's see what's going on here. Greetings! Yeah, this is like a... Like the break. As mm. I expected. Oh my gosh, what a violent person. Oh, dude, this is so cool. Can I can I drink this? I don't think it can. Excuse me, Gordon, but I'm rather busy now. Okay, everyone is busy. This guy, what is he doing? He's like eating. Something. I can't be bothered right now. Okay, these people are very busy right now. Oh, oh boy! What are you doing? Oh no! <laughs> oh dude, I'm sorry guys. Oh wow. I just started pressing. Yeah, why would I do that? I'm sorry dude. I'm sorry guys. I just messed with your lunch. Okay, I'm out of here. <laughs> Okay, these are the lockers. Okay. So let's look for Freeman. Maybe that's where our suit is. Why do we all have why do we all have to wear these ridiculous ties? <laughs> yeah man, I, I feel you. Oh Freeman, okay. Oh there is like a wait, can we pick this up? Because yeah, we don't have the suit on. Look at this. Oh, this Most is his diploma. Simulation results are perfectly acceptable, you know. And his coffee mug and what is this? The orchid eater. What's that other thing, man? Mandala. That's probably his son. I don't know. That's interesting. That was a bit uh, a bit naughty. <laughs> yeah. I wonder if I should run that test again. Okay, uh, yeah, this, these people are talking about a test or something. There is someone like... <laughs> there are some people here like taking a poo-poo. <laughs> okay, here, there is a first aid kit, which makes sense. I hope those containment parameters are still nominal. Okay, man. I don't think you can do anything else here. 
Oh, look at this. Oh, yeah, yes. look at this suit. This is phenomenal. Let's go down. Food is here. I'm a lurk. Uh, enjoy, man. Enjoy, you know. Welcome to the HEV Mark IV protective system for use in hazardous environment conditions. High impact reactive armor activated. Atmospheric contaminant sensors activated. Vital sign monitoring activated. Automatic medical systems engaged. Defensive weapon selection system activated. Munition level monitoring I love, activated. I love the suit. Communications oh, interface online. Have a very safe day. Thank you. Okay, now we do this. I'm digging this music. This is all within theoretical yeah. limits. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm doing the music. Go right on through, sir. Looks like you're in the barrel today. Okay, let's go to test chamber two, because there's... As a... I expected. Look at that rit routine. Access denied. Oh, okay. So only the guard can use that. Oh my god, wait, wait, wait. Okay, wait a second. Okay, left or right? Let's go left. Oh, look at all of these ads. Working as a team. Inspection team to radioactive material handling bay. I can't, I can't read this. Okay, let's keep going. Oh, okay, so they both uh, lead to the same place. Look at this, Black Mesa. Safety. So safety is very important here. Black Mesa Security Force. Yeah, I mean, if they're conducting, like, uh, secret experiments for the government, like, security is the most important thing, right? Bro, using no manual quick saves, I gotta respect that. Silo doors, welcome to the chat, man. I'm glad you're here. Oh boy. Um, yeah, I'm gonna try it, cause I'm kind of, you know, the last time I played this game was like six, seven, eight years ago. I don't remember. I'm just trying to be really careful. Report to Topside Tactical Operations Center. And I played this on normal, so this is my first time playing it on hard. And I just want to make it, you know, I want to spice it up a bit with the, without uh, manual saving, without manual quick saves. So, uh, wait, what's going on here? Why is it, why is this not moving? So yeah, man, I hope you enjoy, I hope you enjoy the, the stream. What is going on? I think I'm going to have to use this ladder. Let's go. Okay, things are already Back going to wrong. West, please report to Vanta Reactor Complex. Okay, yeah, we made it here. Yeah, things are already malfunctioning, so that's not a good omen. Hey guys. I can't be bothered right now. You're supposed to be in the test chamber half an hour ago. Yeah, man, I know I'm late. Okay, uh, test lab access. I think that's where we need to go. Yeah, let's go. Caution. Uh, hello, Gordon Freeman. It's... Sorry, I'm on duty, Mr. Freeman. Okay. Security clear. Oh, I have level 3 clearance. Yeah, let's go. Control room, okay. Think we should Who can say? Those ah, Gordon. And dampening Here factors you are. again. We just sent the sample down to the test chamber. We've boosted the anti-mass okay. spectrometer to 105%. Sample of what? Bit of gamble, but we need the extra resolution. The administrator is very concerned that we get a conclusive analysis of today's sample. I gather they went to some lengths to get it. They're waiting for you, Gordon. 
in the test chamber. Okay, uh, I, I'm guessing it's a sample of Greetings. some weird material, because, I mean, we're working at anomalous materials, so maybe it's like a new element, I don't know. Control room. Ooh, look at this. Oh my gosh. Yeah, this is this reminds me of that Chernobyl series. Like I would stop the test right now. Look at this. I would stop the test right now. I mean, security is like one of the most important things in this company, Black Mesa, so so What's with this negligence, guys? Why won't you stop the test? Let's go. Oh boy. Okay, let's keep let's keep going. Yeah, here's here are the test chambers. Let's go. C33 slash A. Let's go. I'm afraid we'll be deviating a bit from standard analysis procedures today, Gordon. Yes, but with good reason. This is a rare opportunity for us. This is the purest sample we've seen yet. And, potentially, the most unstable. Now, now, if you follow standard insertion procedures, everything will be fine. Yes, yeah, I don't sure. know how you can say that, although I will admit that the possibility of a resonance cascade scenario is extremely unlikely. Gordon doesn't need to hear all this. He's a highly trained professional. We've assured the administrator that nothing will go wrong. Ah, uh, yes, you're right. Gordon, we have complete confidence in you. Well, go ahead. Let's let him in now. Okay, let's let's do this test. But these guys, these guys were trying to deviate from the normal procedure, so those guys are gonna be guilty. Okay, what now? I don't remember what to do here. Where is the sample? Oh, that's the sample. Testing. Oh. Testing. <coughs> Everything seems to be in order. All right, Gordon, I have to do your something. suit should keep you comfortable through all this. The specimen will be delivered to you in a few moments. If you would be so good as to climb up and start the rotors, we can bring the anti-mass spectrometer to 80% and hold it there until the carrier arrives. Okay, so I'm guessing up there is the control panel I have to activate or something. I'm guessing this. Okay, let's start this. Oh, so this is a sample. Go ahead, Gordon. Swap 
the carrier into the analysis port. Okay, let's do this, guys. Oh, this what is he doing in there? Oh, no, I have to worry about Get away from them! Shutting down! Oh my god. It's not. 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 It's Remember this place, man. This is, that's like the last part of the game. Look at these guys. Yeah, those are like. I don't. I don't remember their names, but. Yeah, this is. This was a mess. Yeah, right? Things are going from bad to worse, like... This reminds me, you know, I watched Ch Chernobyl, the, the HBO series with my brother, like, actually, like, less than a week ago. And this is basically that, man. Like, a lot of negligence from workers. I mean, from some of the workers. Oh boy, what's that? So yeah, those aliens or creatures, they're gonna appear later. But I don't, I don't remember how exactly we go with Yeah, I don't Oh my god. Oh, look at this guy. Can I use this? Oh no, this guy's... Let's try to get it done, this. Oh boy. Because, just like Aiden said, things are going to be back to worse. Oof, I don't want to use an elevator in this condition. I really don't want to use... It's just uh, okay. We're fine. Man, dude, guys, come on. I have to evacuate this place. Why didn't they listen? Yeah. We tried to warn them. I never thought I'd see a resonance cascade, let alone create one. Gordon, you're alive. Thank God for that hazard suit. I'm afraid oh, to move dude. him, and all our phones are out. Please, get to the surface as soon as you can and let someone know we're stranded down here. You'll need me to activate the retinal scanners. I'm sure the rest of the science team will gladly help you. Yeah, man, please do. Like, uh, which retinal scanner? Fascinating. Let's go. Yes, let's go. Okay, so I can command this guys as well. Um, so the suit... Oh, jeez. Oh, yo. yeah, look at those suit traps. <laughs> I remember that. You need to be responsible for this mess. Okay, let's keep going. So the suit actually saved me. I would have been dead if it wasn't for this. Access denied. Okay. Oh boy. Whoa, is it is this safe? I'm just gonna wait. Just a flesh wound. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, man, like, what the hell, man? Okay, I think I'm gonna have to time this. Uh, okay, let's go. Uh, I think we're fine. Oh, boy. Oh, okay. Uh, man, I have no weapons. Okay, I'm, have, I'm gonna have to 
try, I'm gonna try to lure this guy and then like run past him. Yeah, see you guys. Oh no, look at this laser stuff. Okay, I've been wondering if the game actually already saved. Like, I'm curious, let's see. Load. Okay, so there are some out auto saves. Okay. Okay, let's go, let's keep going. Oh boy, okay. <laughs> let's be careful, dude. Oh boy, what the fuck? What was that? Okay, let's try this again. Wow, man. Wasn't expecting this. Okay, see ya. Open. What the hell? Why is this thing not opening? Oh boy. Man, that sucked. Medical systems engaged. You know what? I'm just gonna reload because. I took a lot of damage there. Uh, I think this one is the yeah. This one is more recent. Okay, I'm I'm gonna wait for those beams to destroy everything here. Come on, I think I'm gonna take those. This other way, I'm gonna take a lot of damage. Okay, see ya. Okay, we're back here, guys. This thing is gonna blow up. But now, I think I, I think I have to like watch this pattern because I think that that's when I died. Oh my god! That's when I died. Oh boy! Okay, so that repeats. Oh my gosh, is that thing random? Okay, that's that's my shot. See you. Here we are with the with the, with the crowd bar. Um, Dachi man, welcome, welcome. I hope you did good on your stream. How how was your stream, man? And thank you for the raid, of course. Thank you, thank you, thank you, man. Much appreciated. Okay, I think we have to break this. This poor club is so good. I'm actually kind of scared. Oh yeah, we're gonna have to duck. We have to be really careful because um, the lasers are in studded situations. And you know how it is in Tomb Raider. In studded situations suck. We have to be really careful with that. Oh no, yeah. Oh no! <laughs> I think that elevator had people in it. I just killed them, I mean... I, in normal circumstances I would not use an elevator at all in this situation, but since it's a game and I have no other way to go, let's do it. Oh no, look at the... Are those legs? I think those were some legs. Oh my god. Let's just get out of here. Oh no, this Hey man, don't do don't kill him! Don't kill him! Don't kill him! Oh my gosh. And what? Fine team uniforms. Careful man, don't shoot me. Okay. You can do it. Hey man, follow me. Follow me, dude. Follow me. Work together. Yeah, man, you're gonna be my gun for now. For, for now, when I get a gun, it's gonna be a killer team. Batman and Robin. Um. Our luck has to change sooner or later. Stream was good. Finish Chronicles. Oh man, you finished Chronicles. Wow, you're flying. You're flying through 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 those games. 
So I'm ready for Angel of Darkness on Sunday. Man, I'm glad to hear that. To read that, actually. I'm gonna clean up, be right back. Sure thing, man. Murder. <laughs> yeah, man, I murder. I mean, they should not. I mean, I don't know. They should not be in a. In an elevator in, a, in an emergency like this one. Uh, okay, let's go, man. Let's go, buddy. Uh, is this an elevator? I don't remember. Let's go. Man, I'm super, um, I'm super paranoid of something exploding. Okay, man, do your thing. Shoot him. I think you can take him down from this distance. Hey, get away, man. Okay, perfect. Whoa, that was close. I wonder if I can give you like better weapons, because that pistol is not gonna do it when we have to face like a bunch of zombies. Look how the crabs! Oh my gosh! Look at that open torso. That that's. I don't know if horrible. we should go any further. This doesn't look right. So yeah, those head. I think that. Okay, man. Can you shoot that thing? Let's just leave that thing there. Those head crabs uh, just like uh, jump on people and try to control them and turn them into like zombies. Okay, this is like the this is like the launch area. Oh my gosh! Look at all the blood. Oh no! Yeah, this this is what I did. This is the mess I did. I hope these guys are fine, but judging by the blood, I don't think so. Man, I actually forgot to... Where's my locker? Three man. I actually forgot to uh, pick this up. Hour 10%. Hour 20%. So right now we're at 20% health. Um, don't you know, in case of fire, use stairs. <laughs> okay, yeah, you got it, man. The thing is, where are the stairs? I can't use them. So we're gonna have to do it uh, with the elevators. Last Jokers, man! Welcome to the stream, Smell hello! We better be How careful. are you doing, man? Hope you're doing fine. Hope you're having a great day. Let's go, guy, because right now you're like my only defense. Okay, left or right? Let's go. Oh, wait. Well, this is not the way to go. Okay, let's go, Mr. Officer. Oh, no. Look at all these people. Oh, what is that? Oh, hey, man. Bring it on! Uh, bring it on, hell yeah! That's right. What is this button? Oh, I fixed... I fixed something. Okay, let's go back. I think I... I think I can't. Because, yeah, they just opened this... Like, a uh, little space. Oh, no, can you... Can you duck, officer? Like, can you come with me? I think we're gonna have to say goodbye to the officer. That sucks. Oh boy. Oh, look at this. Okay, man. Oh boy. I'm just not gonna bother with that. With that crap. Oh, okay. I have to time this. Oh, I think that okay. He's the here's the jumping duck. There we go. Let's go. Oh no! Ooh, nice man! Oh no, man! Oh no! <laughs> he was so happy because he crushed the crab and man, I'm sorry for you. Uh, 
scientist. I hear one of those freaking things. Dude, can't get in there. Oh my gosh, look at this. That guy is having a seizure. I'm gonna get in here just to explore, but I, if, I, if I can avoid this confrontation, I will. What is this? What? Well, yeah, enjoy your TV show, man. Attention, sector C, science. Okay, I hear, I hear, I hear someone shooting. Oh no. Okay, we have a gun now. We have a pistol now. Only 17 bullets. So... Okay, that was stupid. So, right click. I thought right click was to aim, but I think you can't aim in this game. Like, uh, aim down the sights. So, um, yeah, for the pistol, it's just a normal shot. Everyone is losing their minds, like literally, man. Literally, I think everyone is losing like, their minds. What is that? Oh, what is going on? Okay, um... Man, how can... What do I do here? Oh, never mind. Okay, so one is for the crowbar, two is for the handguns. Okay, let's go. Look at this guy, what is that? Can you attack me? Oh boy! Oh boy! Oh no! Okay, I'm, I'm kinda fucked up. Okay, that's. Those guys tend to do that like, some kind of explosion. Okay, that one is dead. Okay, we're fine, we're fine. Man, I forgot how bad I am at FPS games. Like, my aim sucks. <laughs> my aim sucks. Is it me? Or is the game sound pretty loud? It is loud on purpose. Now, if that is uh, annoying, I can turn it down, because... Uh, in this game, there are no subtitles, and I was, um, I left the game sound really loud so you guys could hear the dialogue. If it's too loud, I can, yeah, it was louder, it was louder, so, uh, I, 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 I don't mind, like, lowering the sound again. But uh, the important thing for me is that you listen to the dialogues, that it is not as quiet, that, that it is not that quiet that you can't hear what, it, what they're talking about. Because the, this game has no subtitles. So as long as you guys can hear the dialogue, I have no problem turning down the volume, the game volume. Oh, okay, so we have to make it up. What is that? Okay, I'm running out of bullets, man. What is... Oh, ew, what? Running out of bullets. I think I'm gonna have to avoid certain confrontations. Like in Silent Hill, man. Oh, look at him! It's the demon! Do you, do you see him? Look at that. Oh no, man, I'm so fucked. I can't... Okay, I'm gonna try to... Cause yeah, they, they explode, man. So I have to be... Yeah, those, like, alien dogs... They explode, man. So I have to be very careful. Yeah, this one is dead. I have to be very careful not to get caught in that blast radius. So the G-Man, man, the G-Man was like looking at us. He's always like watching us. That guy is weird. 
Yeah, get out of here, you freaking dog. I, I'm, I'm listening to some sounds. Um. Also had shit. Oh boy! Ah, what the? Okay, let me read that. Um. Why does it sound like the whole place is exploding? Did you do a poo poo? <laughs> there were some scientists doing a poo poo. But the the thing is, uh, we we right now we're uh, this game is this game is fun. We were doing like um like a test, like an experiment with uh with a sample of some anomalous material, I guess. And yeah, like uh, every everything started started to malfunction. And we actually made a resonance cascade or something like that. Now the the whole the whole test went wrong, more or less like Chernobyl. So now the whole place is exploding. Okay, uh, can I open this door? Oh, what the man, this this guy scared me. What the hell, man? I don't want I don't want to fight those guys because they are really hard to hit. Especially with the crowbars. So I'm just gonna ignore that guy. Oh no, something's going on. Oh what the f Oh no, he hit me! That guy shoots! Okay. Oh no, what is going on? Man, I'm I'm, I'm kinda fucked here. Okay, let's use this. Oh he's waiting for me! I have only wolf I have only five bullets game. I can't okay. Maybe a headshot is an instant instant. Oh no! He's ah he hit me man! I'm not doing very good. I might actually die. Hey, are you dead now? I think it was that was a headshot, but nothing happened. Hey guys, I'm kind of trapped here. Oh no! <laughs> Those creeps. Yeah, sometimes I get really scared. Man, how do we take? Okay, I'm gonna. I think. Oh my gosh, I don't. I need ammo. I'm gonna try to take. No, I have to take care of this freaking thing. Man, we're not doing we're not doing good. Oh, they're giving me morphine. How do I take out this guy? I, I can't seem to take a clean shot. And I can't miss because I have only four bullets. Oh boy. Okay, I'm done. I'm done. I, I don't have any more, so we're just gonna have to like bash him with this, or maybe just run. Oh boy! Okay, I'm just gonna run. Leave me alone! Give me some ammo. All I need is some ammo, and I can take care of that guy. Oh no, man. Okay, that zombie is not that scary. The head crabs are, are scary. Man. Oh, dude, they're gonna kill me. What is going on? This crowbar has a really bad reach, and I'm about, I'm about to die. Oh my gosh, this is hard. Come here, man. Stupid head crap. Hey man. Okay, I'm, I'm gonna try to sneak and just like hit him. Oh dude, you're alive. Wait, give me a second. Let me let me clear the path. Die you mother freak! Okay, there we go. 
This guy is not that scared because he's so slow. Wow, he has a lot of health. What the? F oh no! Minor lacerations detected. Warning. Vital no! Sign. No! He killed the doctor. Man, those guys. What the hell, man? I'm dead. <laughs> Oh no, I'm, I'm screwed, man. Okay, I think I'm supposed to just ignore all, all of these guys, because this is crazy. I need to get in there. I see, like, some grenades and some ammo. How do I do that? Oh, there we go. Access denied. Access denied, come on. No, I think I needed the, the scientist. I think I had to bring the scientist here, but he died. Oh no, he's gonna... Yeah. Oh, fuck. Man, this is... This is insane, man. Okay, we, we're back here, so... I'm gonna save some ammo. I'm gonna kill these guys with the... With the crowbar. Oh no, okay. Jesus! Let's do this. Ah, he actually hit me. Yo, you're done here, buddy. Okay, man. This is hell, man. This is really hard. Like, it's like I told you guys. I don't know if I'm gonna be able to, uh... Do this no loads, uh, no, I mean, no manual saving challenge. But we're gonna try nonetheless, we're gonna try. So let's keep going. It looks fun though. Look at the G Man. Okay, I'm gonna save my bullets for those aliens that shoot uh, green beams. This one is almost dead. Is almost dead. Oh boy. Yeah, he's dead. Yeah, they're dead. Oh my gosh. Okay, let's keep going. Now, what is gonna happen here? I don't remember. Okay, let's check what's going on in this. Oh, dude. There's like a med kit thing here. We have to be very strategic about this. Um, I was AFK, I'm kinda back. I was cleaning under the foam in my room. Baby foam. Oh, okay, it took 45 minutes. Wow, that's a lot. I'm glad. I'm glad you uh, you enjoy taking care of the baby. Um, the music is overpowering you. Okay, so it's it's too loud. Because Dutchy was saying like uh, that it's still too loud. So if that's the case, I'm gonna lower the volume. How's the gra how's the image quality? Hello, poo poo. <laughs> the poo poo trinity, right here, you know. So, uh, is it too loud? Is it still too loud to lower the lower the volume of the game? What's going on here? Okay, so here's. Okay, you know what? I know there is something coming out of here. That's the um, yeah, the freaking head crap. So come here, dude. Man, 
man, I need you to move. And I'm just gonna ignore this guy because he's gonna hit me. Okay, see ya. And now I'm gonna have to take care of those two zombies. I have to. Oh, I can't close this. Whatever. Um. Image is good. Audio is a bit overpowered indeed. Well, can you turn your can you turn yourself up? I am. I'm already at the maximum volume, so I think the answer here is to lower the game, the game volume. Let's try this. Ding dong, that's a new one. Thank you, thank you. Okay, let me guys know if that's better. Let me guys know if that is better. Oh! Man! This guy's... Okay, let's just beat the crap out of this guy. Yeah, okay. Now, we, I'm gonna have to kill these guys. The thing is, they take so much ammo. Man, uh, why, why, what do I do here? I have to save this doctor so he opens that room with his retina, with his eyes. So he can get some ammo. Man, we have to beat that. Okay, you died. Ugh. Oh, look at this. That guy is still unaware. I wonder if I get a, like a critical hit chance. Oh boy, okay. Uh, he hit me, man. I have to avoid that. No! Let's try this with this. Oh, he's dead. Okay. He is dead. We have to take care of the other one. Um, much better. <laughs> that scream. Yeah, man. <laughs> I can't... What is that freaking noise? So hopefully you guys can still hear the dialogues, you know. Yeah, my screams. Uh, I don't know why I make sometimes some weird noises. The scream is so good. <laughs> okay, let's take care of this one here, man. What I'm thinking about is that... Well, I'm gonna get some more ammo, so let's do, let's do this. Cause one, two, three, four, five. So it takes 5 shots to kill them. I hope the damage is not random. And it's consistently 5 shots to kill them. Man, look at that. 3 grenades. Let's do this. Let's do this. Okay, doctor, where are you? Danger, I'm not gonna shoot that. I certainly hope you know what you're doing. I do. Let's go. Shove that crowbar up here of his pool hole. Nah, I don't think he will survive that. That would be a very bad way to go. Oh, come on, man. Don't. Don't. Come here. Come here, man. Oh, what? Stupid. Man, what? Yeah, you're done. Stupid head crap, how could he do this that? As far as I go. What? Why? I need you here, man. Access denied. I need you here, man. What do you mean that's as far as I go? Is this thing still alive? Okay, that's gone. Now can you come? With my brains and your brawn, we'll make an excellent team. We will, man. Now come here. Perfect. Now please use that. Bro, I love you. I love you, man. I hope those people in the Lambda Lab can get this under control. Yeah, who are the people in the Lambda Lab? Oh man, so much ammo! Nice! Man, look at this! 
A 10 grenades? Bro, I have 10 grenades? That's crazy, that's crazy. How many, uh, how much? Man, I'm, I'm loaded. Let's do this. Now let's use this health station. Oh, what's it's depleted. Oh, no. Don't waste, don't waste ammo. I wonder... I think this is like some other kind of ammo. Maybe that's like rifle assault ammo because I can't seem to pick this one up. Okay, um... Let me check something, let me check the connection real quick because as you guys know I like to monitor the connection speed. Okay, seems to be pretty good. So let's go. Um, what's wrong with his face? <laughs> Looks like someone drop kicked it. <laughs> let's see that. <laughs> well, there goes my grant money. Yeah, man. Well, I hope someone comes and rescue you, man. I'll see I you later. This could happen, but the administrator just would not listen. Yeah, man, those administrators always are always so bad. Okay, now can, now we can take care of those guys on the other side. That was the correct order. Oh, I'm gonna use this one as well. Depleted. Can I lean? No, I can't lean. Okay, so there is going to be one guy coming out of this door. Ah, he's gonna shoot me. What? Oh boy, man, he. Ah! Uh. Uh. Man, this guy's gonna kill me! Oh my gosh! Man, I wish I wish I had a shotgun right now. Okay, I don't think I'm doing I think I I should have killed that guy with a grenade because I have ten of them. Yeah, I'm gonna switch okay, what's the Five is for grenades, so I'm gonna try to use that here because I have ten grenades and I left some grenades some grenades up there, so I'm gonna use I'm gonna try to use uh, these grenades more. Oh yes, please. Yeah, let's do this. Now there are a couple of oh look, I think this is the way to go. Oh my gosh. Whatever man, I'm just gonna ignore you. Yeah, look at this guy. There we go. Oh, hey man! What was that? I refuse to go another step. Why? Okay, let's heal here. Man, I need to find some... I think the shield, I mean the uh, suit energy, actually acts like uh, as an armor, so... If you have some energy suit on, I mean suit energy on, um, you actually take less damage. Right now, I'm to completely exposed. Okay, am I missing something? Because there is this like hole up there. Let me see if I can. Okay, can I bring this? Whoa. Okay, let's try to push this all the way there because that might be like a secret or some useful stuff Yeah, 
Yeah, let's let's try that. Um, that's probably shotgun ammo. Yeah, I think it is. Now I just need to find a shotgun. I really need a shotgun to take care of those shooting guys. Okay, can we do this? Okay, now, oh no, that's still kind of... No, I can't, I can't go up there. No, that's way too high, I can't do that. Let's take the bar with us for the whole game. Oh my gosh! You know, I remember that in Half-Life 2, there was an achievement for carrying a gnome. Like a garden gnome. You had to take it with you throughout the whole game. I remember you had to do something like that to earn an achievement. Okay man, are you going just are you just gonna stay there? Okay, stay there man. Okay, I'm gonna have to kill this guy because he's waiting for me. Oh yeah, I'm not I'm did he hit me? There we go, five shots again. Yeah, it was in episode two, that's right. You're right, man. Oh! I hate you freaking traps. Okay, I need to take care of you. Right now. So it's three shots for the head crabs and five shots for the zombies. I get it. Okay, I need to turn this wheel around. Oh no, oh no, I'm gonna run out of air. Okay, let's five let's find the exit because I'm just gonna drown. Oh no, okay, I mean No, never mind. Okay, it's this one. <gasps> okay, yeah, this is the way to go. Perfect. Ew, that's gross. I was actually swimming in that. I don't know what that is. Hopefully it's not sewage. Okay, I have to be really careful because these guys seem to spawn out of nowhere. Here's something. Oh, nice. More ammo. Nice. Perfect. Oh, no. Okay. There we go. Uh, I think I missed my elevator here. I'm, I'm just gonna... Oh my gosh, yeah, if I... Oh! Ooh, ooh, ooh. Okay, I thought I was gonna fall. I'm gonna try to summon back that elevator, like call it back. Oh, I can't. Are you kidding me? I need that elevator. Um, there is also an achievement like that in Left 4 Dead 2. Oh, really? Didn't know that. Man, it, that thing is still going down. Ah, uh, sir, that is poo poo water. <laughs> That's correct, man. That is poo poo water. Oh no, I think I missed my chance, man. Am I dead? Okay, I'm gonna try sliding down. I think I think there is some water down there. 
So I'm just gonna try to aim for the water, not the platform, because... Yeah, this, this way looks... Let's go, guys. Oh, no, I think I'm dead. Ooh, this is not good. No! Oh, look at my pieces of body. Ew. Oh, we're back here. Okay, nice. So, this is what we're gonna do. We're gonna pull down this lever and then s jump straight into the platform. Let's go. Like, screw those crabs. Yeah, there we go. Yeah, they're not coming down. Perfect. Oh no, what are you doing here? Oh no, not here, man. Whoa, what is going on? That one's dead. Okay. Oh no, I'm being... I'm being attacked by the head crabs. I have to move. There are a ton of head crabs falling down on me right now. I have to move. Look at that, man. Oh no, man. Ah, no, they're hitting me. No, they're gonna kill me. Jump to the water. What? Why did I die there? I thought there was water. Oh my gosh. Yeah, poo poo water. That's disgusting. That's disgusting. Okay, well, let's try this again, cuz... I'm gonna try something real quick. I'm gonna... I'm just gonna drop down here. Try to land on the water. Yeah, that's, n that's not gonna work. Okay. That's not gonna work. We actually have to survive those freaking head crabs. That's gonna be a challenge. Oh, of course, I have to pull the lever. <laughs> okay, man. I have to just be really careful of not letting them hit me. Yeah, you're, you're, you're done, man. Yeah, they're missing me. Ouch! Away from here, man. Man, this elevator is hell, what the hell? And at the end it's just worse, it's like all of them decide to fall at the same time, what the hell man? Man, I really need to get off this freaking... Okay, let's jump to the other, let's jump here. Oh no! Jesus! Yeah, you're done. You're done. Okay, there's one of those exploding... Uh, I mean, not exploding, but, sh but shooting. Man, this... Okay, I'm gonna... I'm gonna try the grenade here. Man, so many headcrabs, but there is like a health station over there, so I have to, I have to kill them. Um, it's raining headcrabs, hallelujah. I think the water is either very dirty or it's acid. Yeah, I think it's acid, uh, given the nature of the experiments taking place in this place. Taking, taking place here. <laughs> um, pull the lever, <laughs> wrong, wrong lever. <laughs> what do you even have the lever? Yeah, oh, there are two. Oh no, I missed. I missed that. Oh no. Oh no, there's like a bunch of boxes here. Okay, let me do this because there are a bunch of head crops over there. That sucked, man. That sucked. Okay, that's something. Oh, dude, they're still raining. What? 
there's still Man, I have to do this quick. Oh no! Oh no, guys! <laughs> this is a mess. This is a mess. Oh, I'm, I'm already down here. Ah, oh, damn it. Okay, uh, yeah, we're gonna have to... We're gonna... Uh, there has to be a way to get up there, because I really want to use that health station. I think I'm gonna push this big box. Please tell me you know where that's from. What? The sewage? The water? Wrong lever. Oh, wait a second, wait a second. Pull the lever. Wrong lever. Man, I don't remember. Should I know where that is from? Oh no, the freaking connection, guys. I hope the image quality is, is alright right now. Ah, so many freaking craps. Please tell me no. I, you know, I actually don't remember where that is from, Dachi. Oh no. Let's do this really quick. Okay, let's get out of here. Now let's try moving this big box. Oh, this one doesn't move. Oh no, it's too high for me. Yeah, I think we missed this um, health station. That, that's a shame, but that's fine. Uh, please tell me, you know, uh, we're not friends anymore. Oh no, it's from the Emperor's New Groove. Wow, what? Emperor's New Groove. What are you talking about? Is that a movie? I think you need to jump on there when you're going down. Thing. Yeah, yeah, that's the thing, man. So we completely missed it. Okay, let's keep going. And we're running... Oh, no. What was that? Oh, boy. Okay, that's dangerous. What's going on here? Um, the kids movie with the talking llama. Wow, I never, I never watched that, man. There's so many movies. You know what's weird? Like the 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 game. I mean, the movie you're describing right now. It doesn't ring a bell, but the whole uh, wrong lever thing. It actually rings a bell, so that maybe I watch the movies sometime. It's just that I don't remember right now which one it is. Ooh, that that, that looks dangerous. Okay, so should we? Oh, this one I can't break this one. So this is the way to go. Let's ready our gun. Yes, um. I'm watching some uh some of this energy suit. I mean, suit energy. Power 
Because here's the thing, uh, sometimes when you break boxes, what is that? Oh, I, oh, I remember these things. Sometimes when you, when you break boxes, you can actually find supplies in them. Uh, I'm actually taking a look now at the Black Mesa game. Let's see if it's any good. Man, let me know how it is. Let me let me let me know if it's any good. Okay, let's take care of that guy over there. Ah he hit me. That guy has a lot of health, what the hell? Bro, that guy, how much health does this guy have? Does this guy have? Um, I wasted like 20 bullets on this guy. Whatever, man. Okay, so those guys, if you let yourself... Like, if, if you let them, like, touch you with their tongues... You're dead. Because they're gonna start pulling you up. I see another health station over there, so that's pretty good. Um, let's just make sure we're not missing anything. Ouch. Oh, look at the... Oh, no, that's just... That is just a, a, a bulb. Like a light. <coughs> okay, let's keep going. Okay, what do I do here? Um, I need to get to the other side, but... I think I have to push these boxes. Let's try that. Oh no, the thing is floating away. So there is like a current actually. Let's push this one. Let's go. Man, I'm Okay, okay. We're we're alive. We're alive. So the last time what killed me was one of those like this destroy machines. I don't know how to call them. How do we get out of this? Oh, right here. Oh, look at them. Look at the health station. Okay, let's keep going. Ah, oh, damn it. I hate... I hate you crabs. I hate you crabs. <coughs> okay, let's keep going. Okay, so here the way to go is up. Let's do that. And then we're gonna have to jump. Oh, okay. This reminds me of Tomb Raider with all the platforming. With all the platforming. Let's let's hope I don't die. Cause I'm really bad at platforming in in first person games.
Oh boy, oh! Okay. <laughs> We're fine. No! Damn it. Okay, we're here. Wow, okay, so checkpoints are actually quite often. I can see that they're quite often. I thought it was like a... It was like in Tomb Raider that you could easily lose one hour of progress. Here, there is like an auto autosave like every 10 minutes. So that's, that's awesome. Okay. Okay. Perfect. Awesome. And let's go, man. Okay, we're fine. This gate is closed, so let's come this way. Man, I don't know where we are, where we're at right now. Like, I know our objective is to... Can I see my objective somehow? No. I know my, object uh, my objective right now is to just ex escape this place, like get to the surface and get some help. But with that little detour, man, we're like at the very bottom of this facility. I have no idea where we're at right now. Wait, what? Oh no, no no! I thought I thought it. I thought we were on the other side, but this is actually the way to go. Okay, let's do this. Wow! Whew. Office complex. So this is actually another chapter. Oh my gosh, that guy is dead. Oh no, hey, whoa! Oh, look at those. Oh, they're gonna die anyway. Oh, okay, so that electricity is gonna kill me. Yeah, that's not safe at all. I see there's a med kit here, so I don't know if I want to pick it up. Because I'm right now I'm, not, I'm at 96%, so I'm just gonna pick the energy suit. I mean the suit energy. <laughs> I'm just gonna call it. Dude, watch it! Oh my gosh! Yeah, this guy's done. Okay, I think I have to break this little. Oh my gosh. Can I open this in any way? No, I don't think I can. Well, at least we're back at the office complex. Okay, let me check the connection speed. I hope it's fine. I think it's pretty fine. Let's keep going. Let's keep going. <clears throat> Let's turn on our flash, our, our, our flashlight. Oh, okay, so I'm gonna come this way first because I feel there might be some supplies here, and I really need some ammo. Oh, yeah, the freaking box. Yeah, you can't hear me. You can't hear me here. Oh, I, yeah, I see some ammo. I see some ammo there. Now, the thing is, this fan, I think it will kill me. So, we have to somehow disable electricity. Okay, let's let's go this way. 
Um, Jesus, Black Mesa looks good, but that train ride in the in the beginning takes forever. Yeah, it takes a long time. It takes like here. I think it takes like three or five minutes. The the initial train ride in the original game. Okay, yeah, I'm not gonna walk into that. Oh my gosh. Okay, I think this is another one. Yeah, look at that. Doctor, you have to be careful, man. Gordon, if I'd known it was you, I'd have let you in. Everyone's heading for the service. But I think they're crazy, not to stay put. Someone is bound to come by and rescue us. Okay, man. Do you still say there's nothing to chaos theory? High voltage. Oh, okay, so this is like the generator room. Let's come this way. How interesting. Just look at that. Okay, man. Yeah, you should probably stay there, Doctor, because if you come with me, you're just gonna die. I hear something. What is that? He just said, I hear something. That, that is creepy. Okay, let's go. Let's pick up that ammo. Hmm, perfect. It's not a lot of bullets, but I think it's gonna do fine. Okay, let's let's keep going. Let's keep going. Uh, okay. Yeah, that's that's not safe at all, man. That's not safe at all. With all the electricity. There's a med kit over there. Um I probably don't need it right now. Storage, what is this? Another storage. This the oh boy, look at this. What is that? Wow, that guy's crazy in there. Okay, man. Let's do this. One, two, three, four, five. Yeah, he's done. Um, sorry, I keep going AFK. Don't worry, Megan. It's fine. No need to apologize there. Okay, what's we? Oh, yeah, more ammo. I can't pick this one though. Oh, now I can, okay. Okay, so we have to uh, disable the electricity here if we want to make it to that health station. And we also probably want to go that way. Dr. Newell, schedule case theory RMD. R&D, what is that, like, research and development? Okay, let's, let's go this way. Okay, we're gonna have to break all of this stuff. And we might actually find some supplies in here, in these boxes. So, that's pretty cool. Oh, boy! Stupid crabs, man. Stupid crabs. Hey, man. Glad to see someone alive here. Oh, man, the shotgun! Yes! Oh, yes. Okay, we have the shotgun, guys. 
That's perfect. Oh no, dude, watch it. Okay, oh. I got another one. Yeah, good job, man. What is that smell? What do you mean, what is that smell? Are you serious? Okay, let's pick this shotgun ammo. Man, yeah, I feel so good with my trusty shotgun. Ew. Oh, look at this! Whoa. What is that? Freaking crap. What is that crap? What is that? What is going on? I keep hearing a crab. Is it like up there? Oh, look at him. Yeah, he's done. Wow, now I have a bunch of ammo. Can I pick? Okay. Now let's try to make this jump. No, we have to bring something here. Oh, what's that stench? Are you talking about me, man? What? What? What do you think you? What do you? Th who do you think you are? I'm dying. I just farted on the guy in the UK. <laughs> what is that, man? <laughs> yeah, like. I, I thought he was saying that because of me. Like, what? What is that guy's problem? Saying what is what is my stench? <laughs> So it was just a big coincidence. Right, Tachi? Okay, I see some boxes, but I see no way of getting them back there. I don't know how to get to that air duct. So I think I'm just gonna break this. Ooh, nice. Okay, okay, okay. So, um, I don't know if I'm supposed to come here later. Oh wait, let me try that super jump that we learned in, in the tutorial. Nah, that's not gonna work. Nah, that's not gonna work. This place is a lot bigger than I thought. Okay, do you want to come with me, man? Okay, I'll cover you. Okay, let's go. Um, there is something weird because I can't seem to make that super jump. I think I have to get that jumping module at some point again. Okay, let's go. Now, why do I need you here with me? Because I need to disable the electricity here. Oh, okay. I, th I think I get it. Maybe I have to shoot the switch. This light switch? Nah, that's not the case. Okay, I, I think I'm gonna have to do some... You wait me here, okay, man. Okay, I'll secure this area. Wait, let me see your identification. Ah, never mind. Let's keep going. Um, <clears throat> Man, this seems to be really, really... Oh, boy! Ugh. Okay. Man, that that this seems really dangerous. I think I have to make it to that switch and turn off the electricity. The thing is it it's so dangerous. How is that bug still alive?
Or maybe the water is not... Like, one, it won't hurt me. Oh, no, it's hurting me. Oh, so it's not insta-dead. It just... It just, like, uh, hurts me, but it doesn't kill me instantly. Let's do this. There we go. There we go. 